Christ our King. Alleluia, Amen. Let all with heart and voice before his throne rejoice. Praise is his gracious choice. Alleluia, the Lord again. Alleluia. Amen. Life shall not end the strain. Alleluia. Amen. On heaven's blissful shore, His goodness well Come Christians, join to sing United Methodist Hymnal number 158. The Bible references singing throughout the Old and New Testament. One verse in particular comes to mind is from Ephesians chapter 5 verses 19 through 20 which reads, As you sing psalms and hymns of spiritual songs among yourselves, singing and making melody to the Lord in your hearts giving thanks to God the Father at all times and for everything in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. This is one of the verses that speak of the great majestic hymn, Come Christians Join to Sing. To us in the LCMS, this hymn is also known as Savior When in Dust to Thee from the old red 1941 Lutheran hymnal and is often titled as Spanish Hymn or Madrid. Come, Christians, join to sing. Alleluia. Amen. Loud praise to Christ our King. Alleluia. Amen. Let all with heart and voice before his throne rejoice. Praise is his gracious choice. Alleluia. Amen. The hymn, Come, Christians, join to sing, originally began as a Sunday school song titled, Come, Children, Join to Sing. The hymn's title was changed when the author realized everyone, children and children at heart, loved singing this hymn. This hymn was written in 1843 and first appeared in the Scottish hymn book called Sacred Melodies for Sabbath, School, and Families. This hymn was authored by Christian Henry Bateman, who lived from 1813 to 1889. In 1843, he became a minister in Edinburgh, Scotland. Later in life, he took holy orders from the Church of England and served various parishes, parishes from 1869 until 1884. We are in this hymn as we should in life be giving thanks to God the Father for everything he has done for us in the name of Jesus our Lord. Part of giving thanks is being joyful, especially in times of tribulation. This is where we need the word of our Lord more than ever, as well as to share it with our friends and neighbors, the joyful news of Jesus, who was born to be our substitute, who lived a perfect life, was crucified, died, and buried, was raised on the third day, and ascended into heaven, who sits at the right hand of God. The organ arrangement that you will be hearing is one that I have recently composed myself and is titled Festive Prelude on Madrid or Festive Prelude on Come Christians Join to Sing. And it starts off quietly but joyfully, then builds to a grand toccata with all the trumpets and tubas in dialogue with each other, proclaiming our loudest praises and thanks to God. It is my prayer that you will be uplifted, encouraged, and renewed as you hear this great hymn of our faith.
Blessings to you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. And welcome to the devotional moment from St. Matthew Lutheran Church and Early Childhood Center in Hawthorne Woods, Illinois. St. Paul writes in Ephesians chapter 5, addressing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody to the Lord with all your heart, giving thanks always and for everything to God the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. One thing I have really missed since we have been limited in our ability to be together in the sanctuary for worship is the congregational singing. Music, you see, lifts the spirit and refreshes the soul. Not only is it a release, it is a way in which we give thanks and praise our glorious Lord for all his gifts to us and our relationships with one another. May your heart be lifted by this hymn, and may we soon be able to join together to sing, Alleluia, Amen. Let us pray. Almighty God, beautiful in majesty and majestic in holiness, you have taught us in Holy Scripture to sing your praises and have given us grace to show forth your glory in music. Continue to grant this gift of music to your people, that with joy we on earth may glimpse your beauty and at length know the inexhaustible richness of your new creation. In Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. I am Pastor Timothy Kinney from St. Matthew Lutheran Church and Early Childhood Center in Hawthorne Woods, Illinois, and thank you for joining in this devotional moment.